Then the next shit I'm on the news, man, I went down to Miami. You know, this is about Al Sharpton who got on the news, you know, talking about Eddie said the N-word shit. Let me tell y'all the real story, because the news only gonna give you half of the shit. Nigga, I've flown down to Miami for the... <laughs> for the Black Enterprise uh, golf tennis extravaganza. Now, why they fly my ignorant black ass for some golf tennis extravaganza shit is beyond me to begin with. Because I don't play no motherfucking golf, nigga. I don't like the game. You got to hit a little motherfucking ball, then walk and go hit the motherfucker again. <laughs> Take too much goddamn time. Just pick the shit up, got it. <laughs> so I'm down there. Now, they told me I was there to present. Now, I don't know if you know what presenting is. You know, I get on stage and I say, and the next motherfucker is, good night. <laughs> oh, so I'm sitting there with Moore's Day, nigga. We by the ninth hole at the bar drinking and shit. So Moore's like, are you going to show out tonight? I said, Mars, hold on, nigga. <laughs> I'm here to present, motherfucker. He's like, that ain't what the brochure said. <laughs> so I look at the brochure, man. They got me performing. So five minutes before I'm getting ready to go on to present, Earl Gray Jr. walks up to me. He's like, Eddie, crowd here to see you, man. They want you to do your thing, bro. You understand me? Give them a show, bro. I said, excuse me, brother. Don't you get paid for selling your magazine? Well, I get paid for slanging jokes. You understand me? You ain't about to trick a free show out of niggas, so go find me some joke money. And then jokes can be told. So they go have a huddle. Nigga come back, you know, they found my money. I'm like, all right, cool. You know, we can do show now. He's like, can you do me a favor, brother? Can you not say the N-word or MF? I said, nigga, you mean motherfucker? <laughs> Fuck you talking about, nigga. I'm an artist, motherfucker. This is what I do. For 22 goddamn years, Nick. If you want it, Bill Cosby. No disrespect to Dr. Cosby's form of humor. But if you want it, Dr. Cosby, you should have hired him, nigga. This is Eddie Griffin. I say, nigga, I'm an artist. You wouldn't tell Picasso not to cut his motherfucker ear off. <laughs> you know what I mean? That's like telling Prince, go on stage, but don't play the guitar, nigga. <laughs> so they go have another huddle. He come back, he's like, Ed, hey, you can do you. I said, brother, I'm gonna give you one more chance. I can give you this money back. I can go on and present because I see these bougie motherfuckers in the audience might not understand it. <laughs> he said, no, Ed, you can do you. I said, I'm gonna give you one more chance, nigga. <laughs> he said, no, Ed, you can do you. I said, all right, cool. Nigga, I go out on stage, I grab the mic, and them niggas back there tripping. <laughs> they gonna tell me not to say the N-word, that would be nigga. So I guess I have to say motherfucker, motherfucker, motherfucker. <laughs> And I said, I don't even know what the motherfucking trip is. OJ killed a white woman, walked. Kobe supposedly raped one, walked. Michael Vick killed a dog, the nigga going to jail. That's when they cut the mic off. <laughs> so I dropped the mic, nigga, I said, And walk the fuck off. <laughs>